Hey guys, Joanne here with New ITV. I'm here to do an overview on these Cooler Master I series power supplies. We have the I500, 500 stands for 500 watts, the I600, and the I700. Couple of things to note before getting into the box. This is the I500, but the I600 and the I700 are all 80 plus bronze certified, which means at 20% load, you get 82% efficiency, 50% load, 85% efficiency, and at 100% load, you get 82% efficiency. And they are also, um, they also include a five year warranty. A couple more specs to run through. Um, you get a 120 millimeter sleeve bearing fan with intelligent speed control and a max speed of 2050 RPM and the i6 and 700 have max fan speeds of 2200 RPM. Let's see what else. It is a single plus 12 volt rail design at 38 amps you get 456 total watts you also get over voltage protection over current over power over temperature and short circuit circuit protection and let me just bring in the i600 real quick i want to mention that um the power chart is also a single plus 12 volt rail design 48 amps 576 total watts and one more i700 also Single plus 12 volt rail design, 55 amps, and 660 total watts. Here's everything that comes in the box for the 700 watt power supply. We have the user manual, installation screws, power cord, all very necessary. And a look at your cables. This is a non-modular power supply, just so you know. And uh, over here, we have the 20 plus four main connector. It is sleeved, which is a good thing. And next to that is your four plus four pin CPU plug. You get, let's see how many here, two six plus two pin PCIe connectors, another two six plus two pin uh, PCIe connectors. That makes a total of four. And onto the SATA, you get one, two, three, four SATA, another four SATA, but wait, there is more. You get an, an additional SATA, so that makes nine three Molex plugs, and a floppy. Now, for a look at the power supply itself, it is a very simple design. Here is the uh, 120 millimeter sleeve bearing fan and black on all sides. Oh, power chart, which already went over. And here we have some ventilation holes, as well as uh, your power port and uh, your power switch. Here's a look at the cabling for the i500 and i600 uh, power supplies. They have the same number of cables, so I'm just gonna go over one, obviously. So we have your 20 plus four pin main connector. These are both sleeved. And you get your four plus four pin CPU plug, two six plus two pin PCIe connectors, I believe three SATA, another three SATA, so that's six SATA total, and three Molex and a floppy. And that covers it. That wraps up our overview on these Cooler Master i-Series power supplies. I'm Joanne, and if you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe to our new egg YouTube channel. Thanks for watching New Egg TV, and we'll see you next time.